Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I will show you how to modify your Nikon D5200 camera's 15 minute live view timeout settings to no timeout at all. But before that, please make sure to subscribe to my channel and also turn on the notifications so you don't miss out any of my videos. I want to modify the 15 minute live view of my camera to no time limit at all. Well, first, the Nikon D5200 camera does not have infinity live setting. Now, maybe because of this uh, following consideration, maybe the battery life. Technically, it's a small battery capacity and using the live view will drain your battery fast. Now the workaround here is you can use an external power like this AC that you can plug in. And this may work only if you have a fixed position near to the accessible 220 AC. Also, maybe it was not designed to perform live view and left idle for a specific period of time. Or maybe it was really not considered to perform like a video camcorder function that is attached to an external monitor and recording at all times. Again, why would I want to have an infinity live view? Well, here are my reasons. I want it to perform like a video camcorder that is attached to an external monitor and to a recording device. I want it like to be a webcam that can be used for my live streams. And also, I want to maximize the potential of this device and also, I don't want to spend money for another camera. Now, here are the steps on how to modify your Nikon D5200 Live View 15 minute timeout settings. First, you have to check the firmware version of your camera. To do this, on your camera, press menu button, then scroll down to the setup menu. On the right navigation, scroll all the way down to the firmware and press OK. The C should be 1.02 and the L should be 2.002. Press OK to select None. Now if your version is lower than 1.02, you might want to upgrade the version first. Now uh, the link below is the official firmware for Nikon D5200 camera. I will also leave a link on the description below. Now you download the unpatched 1.02 version of the firmware for your Nikon D5200 camera. Upgrade the firmware. Now, to upgrade the firmware version to 1.02, just follow these steps. Warning, use at your own risk. Firmware patch may damage your camera, so take extra precaution. Make sure the battery is fully charged or have an external power during the firmware upgrade. Never interrupt the camera during the upgrade process. Extract the downloaded and patched firmware and copy-paste it to the root directory of the SD card of your camera. Insert the SD card to your camera, then power it on. On your camera, press menu button, scroll down to the setup menu. On the right navigation, scroll all the way down to firmware and press OK. Scroll up to select Yes and press OK to proceed and begin the firmware update. Again, warning, do not power off, remove the battery or remove to external power. This will damage your camera. Once firmware upgrade is done, your camera will now reboot. Reconfirm, check the firmware version. Now using the downloaded firmware, we will now modify it by patching through this website. To patch the firmware, go to this website I will leave a link down below now this patch will modify the live view of your camera the 15 minute live view timeout will no longer take effect it will now turn into unlimited live view this is what we need to make your D5200 camera to be used as external web camera now on the website locate your downloaded firmware named D5200 underscore 0102 bin. 
now extracted. Then, upload it. Then on the selection, select the 15 minute live view, no timeout. Then, save the patch firmware. Now, locate the patch underscore D5200 underscore 102 bin. Save it to a new folder. Identify it as the patch firmware. And then, rename the patch underscore D5200 underscore 0102 dot bin to D5200 underscore 0102 dot bin. Copy the patch D5200 underscore 0102 dot bin to your Nikon's cameras memory card root directory. Load the memory card to the camera, then follow again the step 4 on how to upgrade the firmware version. Again, use at your own risk. The firmware may damage your camera so take extra precaution. Once the firmware upgrade is done, your camera will reboot. Reconfirm the firmware version. Now change the timeout settings to 15 minutes so that you can use your Decon D5200 camera as a webcam without timeout interruption. I hope you find this Nikon D5200 firmware patch useful to your camera. If you like this video, don't forget to click like and subscribe. Hit the bell notification for more videos. Again, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time and peace.